Takumi, there you are. Where have you been the past few days? I've been looking all over for you. Prince Leo. So, what's with the formal welcome? Mm, nothing. Hmm. Let me guess. You're upset because of how happy our siblings are that we're getting along. So you're pretending like we're enemies again. What? what How could you get all that from two words? Oh, come now, Takumi. You should know by now that I can... Read me like a book. Yeah, yeah, I know. You're so predictable. Well, I had no idea that knowledge of my companions was so detestable. No, I just... <sighs> Sorry, you're right. Every time I talk to Hinoka and Ryoma, they ask me how you're doing. What's Prince Leo been up to? Aren't you going to hang out with him today? They talk to me more than ever now, but only about us. Knowing how alike we are, I bet your siblings are doing the same thing. Hmm. Well, you wouldn't be remiss in believing so. Isn't it awful? I feel so... dismissed. It seems to you as if they're relegating us to each other. As though somehow, if we're friends, we can just babysit each other, right? And that way, they don't have to deal with us. See what I'm saying? Yes. I understand all too well. Just another way we're alike, I guess. Damn it all. Hold on, Takumi. I said I understand. I didn't say you were right. Hmm? When will we learn to stop imprisoning ourselves in our sibling shadows? Takumi, I felt the same way you do. Truly, I did. We spent many a day vying for our sibling's affection. Their approval. So when they insisted we spend more and more time together, it felt... Isolating. But my view changed the other day, when Sakura requested to speak to me. She wanted to thank me for being your friend. She said that she hadn't seen you smile at someone so genuinely in a long time. What? what Seriously? When was she even looking at me that closely? Why'd she even thank you? I can make friends. I can. Relax, Takumi. That's not all she said. She said that she was glad there was someone you could finally open up to. Great. So what? Don't you get it? We're the ones who've been isolating them. We're weak, but we want to pretend we're strong. So we suffer in silence, away from them. So now you're calling me weak? Oh, come on, don't be pedantic. You know what I mean. They're our family. They love us. They want us to be happy. I know it's hard to believe that. I doubt it most of the time as well. That's just it. I can't believe that. That can't be it. If that were true, they wouldn't be ignoring me. They wouldn't be trying to force me away and sending me to you. But... I shouldn't be taken it out by avoiding you. Sorry. You're missing the point again. That's not why they were trying to get you to talk to me. Why do you think I've been trying so hard to find you? Huh? I... I have no idea. Why? <sighs> this was supposed to be a grand occasion, but since you've decided to play hide and seek, I suppose this will have to suffice. That's... That's a ring! Leo, does that mean you... It's not often you find someone who resonates with you so deeply. Unless you're still a companion in the shadows of those whose greatness looms above us. I... thought that would be enough. I thought I was satisfied. But I don't want to bask in the shadows of self-pity forever. I want to achieve a greatness worthy of its own recognition. With you, Takumi. So yes, this is a ring. It means that I care for you above all else. It means that I love you, Takumi. That's... you... I... I... <laughs> you don't need to say it back. I know you do too. What do you mean? I know you do too. Please, I haven't seen such a furtive dance around courtship in my life. The fidgeting, the red-faced stammers, the glance of little Sakura caught you steal. So that's why she was looking at me like that. I spent the last week asking your siblings for their blessings. They all said I didn't need it. That's why they've been pushing you towards me so that I could propose. Propose? That's the grand occasion, isn't it? Leo, you had a big celebration planned for this, didn't you? That's... Takumi, 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 how long are you going to underestimate me? All your friends and family congratulating you on finally finding true love? I know there's nothing you would hate more. Finally? You're lucky you found someone who can stand your papa's self. <laughs> I suppose I am and I would never do anything to risk losing him. So how's this for a grand occasion? Dinner alone, dancing, a play mayhaps, and then, if the time is right, I'll propose for real. That sounds perfect, actually. Like a dream come true. 
I thought it might. Then let's go. We... we don't need to tell anyone just yet. Who knows? If it all goes well, I'll say I love you and accept. Maybe. Oh, I know you will. I'll make sure of it.